this is the town of Slavkov in uh, Czech Republic near Brno. I've got a map up here, which is always handy for people like me who don't bother with maps. Anyway, so there's Slavkov. Now, the Battle of Ostelitz um, was somewhere over here. I can't remember the name of this place here, Kovalovica. La Jovica, I think that's where the French... Oh, heavy cavalry and the Russian medium cavalry, or maybe it was the other way around, clashed. But with the, the Russians being forced into this river, they're back of it, I think. I think that was anyway. But anyway, I'm going to try and find this a bit later. But for the moment, I'm going to uh, stay in this town and have a look around. I would normally start off by filming the cemetery, but it's the first thing I come to. Here's the church, which is uh, 1743. And as one sees everywhere throughout Europe, as the victims of this small town to the Nazis, from the Nazis were never at war. Now I know that this road leads to the Maiden Square because I went round the outside of the town. I wonder, is that part of the town wall with the door in it? Not big deck, which means furniture. Charm this place. Today's the 23rd of May 2009. It's approximately 15.30 now. And Saturday afternoon, the opening's closed. That building is the synagogue. It's um, built in 1858. I must say it's in incredibly good condition considering the, there's no one here to use it any longer. And uh, it's about 130 uh, people uh, from here were Jewish. They were murdered by the Nazis. Oh, uh, it really is in good condition. There's also a Jewish uh, cemetery here. I believe this area was the, the, the it was called the ghetto. It wasn't. I think it was right to call it the ghetto. It was the Jewish part of the town. Oh, they've even got British telephones here. <laughs> Apparently it's an imitation tele um, telephone booth, but uh, never mind. It's made of wood, as I recall. I can't remember what they're made of. So it didn't look like that. It's last COVID day, it's 29th of May, so I've come a week too early. So I've got myself uh, three maps, one, two, three, 
and that will uh, should be sufficient to see me around. Um, I sort of remember when the Battle of Osterlitz was, and the, uh, in fact, I think no more than the lady in there about who attacked where, but at least she told me how to get to the places, uh, which I didn't know. Oh, no shortage of police down there. I must have known I've arrived. So here we have the Osterlitz Castle. No, it's written in English, Nash. And which uh, the European Union has been forking out for, though no doubt people are right from Czech Republic denying this, as they have for everything else that I've put up saying similar things. Who could have thought that this place has a railway station named after it in Paris? One of the big ones. Here's the park, which I think is closed in the winter. Well, I was about to warn them not to do it, but it seems I was too late. Oh dear. In a few months time he'll be wishing he'd listen to me. Still, if he'd met me yesterday, I could have talked him out of it. Even an hour ago it probably wasn't too late. Oh, the, the poor so-and-so. Now isn't that magnificent? Wonderful. Now the entrance to the castle is, uh, is through the park here, and it's paid. Mind you, I'm not certain getting married is good enough reason to get around the payment to get into the castle. So, anyway, maybe she was pregnant. Think, boys, it's 10 minutes of pleasure really worth 50 years of hell. Oh, what a wonderful palace. Italian style. Or something like that. There's some gentlemen being filled for the local television. But there'll be more people see my films than that see uh, him on telly. I must say this is very, very unpleasant. Yeah. Certainly better than that awful railway station in Paris. And there's a funny monument. Or something. here longer. But if I'm going to see this battle before it closes, then I'm, uh, I'm going to have to go. And this is the street, it's a hospital street, and uh, it's a St. John the Baptist church. I thought it meant St. John the Baptist when I saw it, but now I've seen the translation in English. And uh, going down here, there's also a Jewish cemetery outside of the town, which I've been close to seven years, but I thought of, thought of going there as well, but I don't think I'm going to lady up and get me the key. See the battle first, not the fight.